Yo, what's up everybody? How is it going? Today we're playing Metal Man, so we're going into the midline. I'm sorry that we're starting a little late. Uh, I had to finish a Hearthstone match, not even gonna lie. But I did beat that Fallout beat him good. Uh, Grim Patron, I'm enjoying my last few days of Grim Patron because soon the new... Now, a new expansion is coming, and with that, Grim Patron is probably dead, and I'm just like, no, it's my favorite deck. Anyway, so we're playing Venomancer here. Gonna be going up against the Queen of Pain in the mid lane. And Venomancer mid, yes, this is actually legit. This is not just me fucking around, this is actually legit. You'll see in a second why. Um, I did actually pick Venomancer to kind of deal with an OD. That's how legit I think this is. <laughs> um... So yeah, we'll see how this works out first. I think we should be fine, honestly. Now, you may have noticed I started with a Ring of Basilisk. That's a very uncommon starting build. I don't know if this is any good. I just wanted to try it, right? Is this good? I have no fucking clue. Probably not. But um, it's not really about being good. It's about, like, I just wanted to see how this works out. So what do we do with Venomancer? We put down these wards, right? They have 200 life, which is plenty, and they deal a decent amount of damage. And then we just use them as like a little safe space. Right, it's just like, oh hey, this is just where we are and um, you know, we'll just fight her. Not even gonna scale my Q for a little while. It's just not a priority at all. Right, and then we just hit her. And as you may have noticed, we're actually doing really, really well. Right, she's gonna have to farm under her tower all the time. Which is a problem because it's really difficult to last it under a tower. Uh, Again, I always bring this up, but even pro players can't do it properly, right? Like, it's one of those things that you would expect, okay, you know what, you should just be able to get all the last hits then, right? No, no, nobody can do that. It's too difficult, right? And and sometimes you just can't do it, it's just not possible, right? But yeah, so I'm just, you know, sitting here spamming like crazy, creating my little, little, like, you know, siege tank army. <laughs> because these guys hurt! They are strong, right? They are very powerful units, and um, yeah, so that's kind of the plan here. And then we'll just, you know, get a few hits in on her occasionally with our passive. Um, these hurt very much so. Each of each of our attacks is very powerful, right? Um, the wards also have very powerful attacks. So one attack, if I hit uh, hit her, right, is nine seconds of twelve damage a second. That's uh, one. Like is that one hundred and eight damage? That's a lot. Right, that is a lot, that, that actually quite, quite matters quite significantly. So yeah, and um, that's kind of what we're gonna do with Venomance, so honestly, like, it's really strong. <laughs> it's kind of a really powerful strategy, and we can definitely use this to just, you know, slowly destroy her. Right, and she'll just not get to do much about it. It's just really rough. It's a really rough thing to do to somebody, but hey, we don't care. Anyhow. Anyhow, I guess that's that. Um, you can see it's working pretty well. Right, I'm doing really, really well here. She's not. <laughs> and um, it's very difficult to initiate on us as well, right? Because if she dares to jump us, there are these wards everywhere protecting us. And that doesn't really work. You just can't really go in on that, right? You'll just die. Anyhow. Anyhow. So, uh... We are watching House right now. Yeah, House MD. Dr. House. I haven't actually... I have actually never seen much House at all. Like, it's the first time I'm watching it. It's actually really nice. Although... <laughs> every episode is the same fucking episode, man. Every single one of them. They're all cool, but they're all the same episode. Um, it's always the exact same thing, right? It's always the exact same thing. It's like... Oh, hello. It's like... Dr. House finds something, like there's a patient that he's like, oh, this guy is not interesting. And then it's like, but House, the patient has this. Oh, now he has interesting. No, it's very obvious what the patient has in terms of sickness. It is this. No, it is not that. I tell you, it is not that. But House, you are insane. You're wrong. It is that. Let's run some tests. See, House, I told you it was that that we fought originally. No, it is not that. You don't know what you're talking about. Oh my god, a new symptom. It is not that what we fought. House, you were right all along, but we still don't know what it is. Oh, random thing that didn't pop up until now it happened. Oh, oh, now we know what it is. Oh, thank God, House. You are the best. You saved the man's life again. Oh, you didn't. Sometimes they die. The I think is really cool, actually. I really like that sometimes they just fucking die. 
And it's like, it's not always a happy ending, right? It's not always like, yeah, you know, everybody's fine. No, sometimes they just fucking die. It's like, okay. <laughs> I think that's really cool. I actually really like that. I know it sounds a bit silly to say that you are, like, I'm happy to see that you know, sometimes the, the patients die. But I just think that makes it more interesting, right? That gives it more tension that, you know, sometimes they just, it just doesn't work out. Sometimes you just can't do it. There's no saving. Well, I don't know, I like that. Anyway, very good show. Very interesting, very much enjoying it, but it's always the same fucking thing. Every episode is the same episode. <laughs> but hey, I can deal with that. Anyhow, uh, we, uh, might, we might get a hand of minus. I'm actually really tempted to get a hand of minus. Um, you know, you do need levels with this, heroes, uh, and this hero, and he struggles a little to farm. Right, so I feel, I feel like getting an early hand of minus wouldn't be too bad of an idea. Um... We can get it pretty early too. Right? We just got boots, bottle, and then you know we need like a thousand more gold for the hand of minus, but that's totally manageable. As you can see, it's not like we ever have to do anything in this lane. <laughs> you see that Queen of Pain? I've not done jack shit to her. I'm not attacking her. I'm not. I'm not doing anything to her. But she just, you no, know, she's just dying because it's like, oh my god, can this stop? No, this is not stopping ever. Hello. Rip. Sorry about that. <laughs> Sorry about that, man. Uh, that has to suck. Alright. Let me go ahead and grab my... My healing potion really quick. And bottle crow. But hey! Uh, Queen of Fates ultimate is done, by the way. Um, you know? That was like her desper desperate attempt, attempt at getting a kill. Would have worked, but I had an invisibility. She had all the time in the world to figure that out, though. So that's really her own fault. Right, like, she shouldn't have jumped right there. She had all the time in the world to see that I have an invis. Um, but she didn't check. That's what happens if you don't check for something like that. Anyhow, our Wall of Pain is just going to continue sieging. You know? It's just like, whatever. No. I don't, really, I don't really care what you're doing, Queen of Pain. I'm just not that interested. Although I think it's time to actually take this tower, right? Um, so how we do this is we put down this, we use our ultimate, right? Now she has to retreat. She just has to, right? And that means we get the tower. Sweet. Hello. Oh, God. Yeah, sorry, guys. No. <laughs> sorry, but no. And I appreciate it, but no. All right. Um, yeah. let me go ahead and head into the jungle and get myself some creeps. Your bottom tower ain't I mean, I got my hand of Midas now, right? And I'm gonna use that really quick, get also that guy. Yeah, um, I've been playing a decent amount of Venomans mid, actually. Like, a surprising amount, let's just say it that way. And uh, the thing is, I've noticed that I you run out of steam. You run out of steam, right? You do really, really well early on, like super early on, you do super well. Uh, but then you just stop. Right, because you just don't really, you know, can't really keep up. You just kind of run out of steam because you don't farm that well, right? And um, you need a little bit, you always need a little bit more money than you actually have. And it just sucks. So I feel like the Hand of Midas is really going to help with that. going to, like, help keep the pressure up. I feel like that's pretty important. Um, especially against a hero like an OD. So yeah, that's kind of the thing here. Now what are we building in terms of items? I am not quite sure. Your skulls roundness offense. <laughs> That's a great line, man. That's a great line. I'm not really entirely sure. So there are a few items we definitely want. Um Agonims, Octarine Core, Weight of Discord. Um Ether Lens is pretty sick because we deal so much damage. This hero actually deals an insane amount insane amount of damage, right? Um Ether Lens is pretty sick. Also increases the cast range on our stuff. And, you know, that's nice. Although I don't think Ethelance is necessarily required. So that makes it a little bit tricky if I should go for it. Never really quite sure. Nah, okay, I guess not. Right, I'm never really quite sure if Ethelance is actually worth it. Um, it's not bad. It just, I don't know if it's good enough. Right, because we really need, like, a few things. Or we really need that Veil of Discord. Blink Dagger is fucking amazing as well. And required. Like, you need mobility. And we got to disconnect. Right, so there's 
just a few things that we gotta get and we really need them but um it's just a lot right like if we look at the items right now like i want the blink dagger right so that's 2.15 uh, 2.25 grand um we're considering ethelance so we're like 4.5 right weight of discord so we had like what uh like 6.7 right uh agonims so we have like what is that 11 Eleven thousand gold right there. That's a lot. That's a lot, right? And I don't really know what to do about that. Mm, like we, I don't know if I can get there, right? Like that's a lot of fucking money. I'm not sure if I can just make eleven grand magically appear. But that's what we have the hand of minus for, right? That's gonna be handy for sure. Oh well, we'll see. We'll see. Uh, this is probably gonna be a pretty farm heavy game, but I'm just gonna be pushing the mid like I am. Right, just gonna keep applying the pressure here. This is just keep this going, right? I'm forcing them to like center their attention on the mid. Uh, um, that's pretty useful. Pretty useful for my team. I think the first thing I'm gonna go for is the Veil of Discord though. So Veil of Discord is super sick uh, because you just deal so much damage. And it's actually some really nice stats as well. It's something a lot of people don't really talk about, but um Made of Discord gives some sick ass stats. Like, really, really good. Super useful. So, um. You know, we're gonna go ahead and grab ourselves that. You're dead. Ah, she's maybe not dead. Uh, I'm hoping that you are dead. Come on! Um, I don't know if they are dead. <laughs> maybe. I got one! <laughs> Got one! We got one! Alright, we're good. Got the Legion Commander. I mean, that's alright. Oh, might even get another! Uh, Vacuum? No. That's that's a high level of magic immunity for this early on. Seems he hasn't skilled the passive. I actually like that. I don't I don't really think though. I mean, that passive is all that good. It's not bad, but it's definitely overrated. Uh, I guess. I don't really do that much, but I guess. Hello. Mm. Grab this really quick. I'm not that fast. Guys, you gotta wait for me. Mm -hmm. I'm just as like Need weird snake. Chop this. Come on. Oh, uh, Korea. Guys, I'm baiting. No. Touch of venom. no! No! I really wanted that. Alright. Yeah. Rip. Let's push. Push, 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 push. Let's go and get this tower. Can easily do that. No, leave my board alone, you asshole. What's that about? Yeah. I don't need that. I don't need that. And we have Veil of Discord now, which means we deal a lot of damage. Like, seriously, it's a lot. Don't underestimate how much damage we're talking about here. This hurts. So usually, um, by the way, in the mid lane, you saw me not put these guys into tower range. Because I was just using the creep wave to push. Um, these guys can definitely be useful pushing a tower too. I bet the problem is they, you know, aren't that tanky and, you know, I don't know, then they just die in the mid lane. So in the mid lane, you don't necessarily want to put them in tower range, keep them outside. But while pushing, definitely, right? Put them into tower range. Get that shit. Or just be aggressive. Be aggressive. Be strong. Show dominance, man. That's what it's about. All right, let's get another tower. Let's just get another tower. You just go in the jungle or some shit, man. You got it. I believe in you. I believe in you. There we go. Now we got our we got our ultimate ready too, right? And ultimate is kind of good, <laughs> especially now that we got the veil of discord. Um, we'll go ahead and take this guy. Especially now that we got the veil of discord, this ultimate is kind of a little sick. So I'm gonna go ahead and take that. Uh, you can see why I started with the Ring of Basilis, right? I don't know, I just like having a Ring of Basilis on this you know, here. Going for, which is really good. Uh, invis or blink? No, she's good, it's blink. Oh. If she's bad, and it's invis. Is she good or is she bad? The other fella's bottom tower. Wait, she, know yet. <laughs> <laughs> she was jungling. And actually, the right call this game. So that doesn't really help us. Watch this that that's that's the... Well, she's still going for Blink or Invis. Like, that's still happening. 
The question is just which one is it? Alright. Do I rush Agonims right now or do I get my Blink Dagger? I think I'm actually more keen on the Blink Dagger. So, uh, the thing about Venomancer, by the way, this hero is a suicide bomber. Okay, you need to keep this in mind, right? Like, our goal this game is to jump in, blast them with spells, put the Bane of Discord on them, and then probably die. <laughs> right? That's okay. That is fine. They don't want to fight me. They won't just Bane of Discord and ultimate them. It's just scary. Right? Um. Hello. Okay, shackle couldn't connect. That's all right. Please tell me we're fighting. That would be so nice. Oh yes. Come on, let's do this, man. You know you want to. You know you want to. Come on, you're waiting for it. You're waiting for it, just like I am, man. Just like I am. We're all waiting for the moment. Come on. Go for it. Go for it. Waiting, man. This is what I expect of you. This is what we believe in, man. We need you. Just initiate on the shit. Go for me. I'm just some banana dude. Right? I'm just like a walking banana. Just attack it. Okay, what what is a walking banana gonna do, huh? That's what I ask you. I think I might actually just go rush Agonims. I know it sounds a bit silly, but I feel like it's actually the right choice. Mostly because, um, you know, I, I feel like they're gonna jump us anyway. I don't really need a blink dagger. And they're gonna be all over us. Oh, seems you're fighting. Oh, yes! Mm, this is it, man! This is it! This is the dream! This is the moment! You're dead. You're fucking dead. <laughs> okay, you're, you're maybe okay. No. No, 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 no. You guys are out. You're out of here. <laughs> I'm just gonna keep sieging, man. I'm the fucking tank. Ugh. I have 900 life and I'm the siege tank. Let's go. Mm, I don't actually know. Are siege tanks... I don't know that much about StarCraft anymore. I used to be pretty into that, but not so much anymore. Man, not so much anymore. I mean, not at all anymore. I mean, nobody fucking plays that game anymore. Man. That's really sad, isn't it? I mean, StarCraft is kind of a sick game. Like, StarCraft is actually kind of really amazing, but... Oh, well, I think... Well, are we still going? I don't think we should still be going. We should probably go out here now. Oh, God. No problem. Okay, well, of Discord. Oh! Heal up! Okay. Sorry, boys. <laughs> sorry. I know I'm leaving. I'm really sorry, man. <laughs> I don't know how I could ever forgive you for not saving me from something I could never be saved from. I don't know. I don't know, Matt. Please find it in your heart. Alright, anyway, uh, we're 18 minutes into the video, if you enjoyed it so far, please don't forget to do a rating on the video. Uh, it's not been a lot of kills, but I think we have definitely had a lot of action, right? It's just, like, a little different. But I like doing stuff like this, right? Like, just, here you go. This is how you can, this is something you can do with Metalmancer. Did you know that? If so, cool. No? Hey, I hope you learned something interesting, right? Because that's, to me, the most, that's, to me, one of the coolest parts of Dota, right? Always figuring something new out. Like, it's just like, oh god, there's this cool shit, and this cool shit, and this is also amazing! Right? Just a feeling I'm currently kind of a little I'm missing, because, you know, just the, the patch has been around for so long, and I'm kind of waiting for a new patch just so I can get that feeling again. Because that's really, like, to me, that makes Dota what it is, right? It makes it amazing. The aspect of discovering and learning new stuff because there's so much to it and there's so much to learn With Vim and yeah. there we go I got Agonims <laughs> that's a pretty early Agonims I would say I'm quite quite happy with this Agonims also there's all, Agonims does a few things for us uh, first of all gives us really nice stats which we can definitely use secondly damage increase on the ultimate right significant damage increase and at level 16, right, our ultimate is going to have a significantly lower cooldown. So, um, you know, 60 seconds on this, that's amazing. That's just really, really good. So, yeah, that's something I'm looking for you. 
bunch of venom. Right. Also, you know, now we are a little tanky at the very least. <laughs> Just a bit, not too tanky, but you know, yes. we'll take it. <laughs> Alright, it seems the Eva Lens isn't happening this game, but that's alright. I mean, who really needs an Eva Lens anyway? These boxes, by the way, are actually like super awesome for Metalmancer, because now you can always make sure that you aren't putting them inside of the, inside of the, the spawn box. Right, the wards. Yeah. Really, really handy. Um, definitely a buff, I would argue. Right. I would argue that's just like a straight up buff to the hero. But yeah, we can now use this to like, kind of bait the creeps out and we never have to worry about actually blocking the camp with them. That's an illusion. Alright, these guys should be able to handle it. <clears throat> Don't really need me for that, do they? Uh, oh look at that. I think they smoked up. Oh look at that. Okay, you're dead. She's dead. I'm dead too, but she's dead. <laughs> oh, the TP out. Nope, dead. Nope. Not making it, man. You're not making it. <laughs> oh, this guy is also... Ah, oh, he's got magic immunity, though. Nope. That's unfortunate. That's unfortunate. Well, I got one of them at least. Right, I got one of them at least. Kind of tempted to just go for the... Um, uh, TP boots. Right, but... I oh, know, I wish I had okay, some mobility. But, okay, she's got Blink Tiger. Alright, this is where shit gets real. So she's a smart legion, damn it. This is where shit gets real. We've got Juggernaut farming, though, and Juggernaut is doing alright. Uh, Desolator early, that's interesting. That's very aggressive, he needs some survivability now. Hmm. Wonder what that's gonna end up being. Alright, uh, we definitely need our... T we definitely need TP still, right? So... I feel like just going for TP boots, like, going for, like, just straight up, like, six slot Metal Man, so... Not, you know, like, okay, so there are two different ways of playing Dota, and, like, you can either just, like, slowly build up to your six slot, or you just go for the six slot, right? You don't buy small items and replace them, like, once you get to the point where you can start thinking about being six slot. No, we just got, we, we, we gotta build for six slot, so we're just gonna start out with a butterfly, fuck it. Right? Okay. Yeah. Alright. No, I don't think that hit him. Okay, I just hit him. A little. Oh god, that's me. No, no, no. Oh, Alright, I'm gonna try to get some damage in here. Sorry, boys! Okay, we got a problem. Um. You know what? Fuck you, man. Fuck you. Alright, I should be dead. Oh, no, no, we're good, we're good, we're good. <laughs> we're good! Alright, TP boots time. Time for some TP boots, man. Oh, that was close, but it worked! It worked! Don't be afraid to Blade Fury on an Omni Knight. Quick as Venom. Yeah, if he's magic immune, you can't just attack him. Yeah, and Blade Fury should stop him slowing you, I think. Yeah. Right, so if the Omni Knight has like magic immunity, you can't just spin and right click him regularly. The this is just weird. Yes you can. You can right hit while Blade Fury. You can if they are magic immune. He, I think he Juggernaut even attacks regularly, he just doesn't deal damage. Ugly do Norn. <laughs> he is pretty ugly, holy shit, man. <laughs> that's an ugly Juggernaut. Dude, that's a disgusting Juggernaut. Holy shit. Alright. Dude, what's that face? Okay. I've never seen a more disgusting Juggernaut in my life. What the fuck? <laughs> that is the worst <laughs> fucking <laughs> Juggernaut. <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with that Juggernaut? <laughs> oh my god. Alright, I guess we're TPing on. I was gonna TP in, but I guess we're not doing that. Alright. That is the worst juggernaut. <laughs> Look at that guy! <laughs> yeah. 
I'm gonna cool down, but that's alright. Alright. <sighs> so, Octarine Core is gonna be really sick. Uh, because, you know. Is she real? I think that's real, actually. Well, oh, that's. Because you wasn't paying attention, that's what you get, Beach. Alright. Got an ultimate ready. I got my ultimate good. Okay. Motherfuckers. Oh, I hit I hit Domino. Oh, he's matching me. No, he's not. Oh, he is. Alright, that's a little different. Hello. Get out. I'm sieging. I'm busy. <laughs> <laughs> I have no time for this nonsense. I am busy. Either you fight me or you don't. Okay? Thank you. So please, don't. Alright, don't do that nonsense. Like, you can't get past those, man. You're just not getting past my wall of pain. Like, good luck. Hmm. I really want a blink dagger. I really don't think I should get one. All right, fuck you, man. Ooh. Okay, we got the duel. May ah, I'm dead. Yeah, I'm dead. This is pretty bad, isn't it? Yeah, these guys are fine. Oops. <laughs> you really shouldn't go in on this. Just leave it. It's all right. Get back. TP top. That's fine. TP top. <clears throat> yeah, I got greedy. I mean, it's gonna happen at some point, right? So what do we build next? Again, like, Blink Dagger is really good. Just for the mobility. Right, like, we, 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 want the, we want the mobility. We want to be able to um, go in and catch them. Right, and then, like, put the big poison over on everybody. Interestingly enough, the big poison over on everybody is actually usually enough to kind of keep us alive. Since it chases them off, right? They get scared. They don't want to fight into that, so they just run. And, um... Your mid -towers yeah, that would be kind of neat. But, uh... I don't know. Alright. Alright, we got the max ultimate. I think I'm gonna go for the Blink Dagger. Yeah. I don't know, I think I should also probably get a BKB, but that's something I definitely don't want to do. I think I might just get Dr. Rain next. Um, but BKB, man. Just against OD. Could also get Ghost Sip, that might be pretty sick. I mean, they are mostly just right click, right? I mean, Wind Ranger is mostly right click. Okay, they got Queen of Pain, but you can't do anything. Like, Ghost Scepter is not a negative aspect. Uh, like, negative. It does not have the downside to, uh, like, in regards to your ultimate, because that's pure anyway. Alright, so it's just like, whatever. Okay, you are dead. Okay, I'm dead. That's fine. Oh, I'm not dead. Ah, I'm dead. <laughs> That's fine. This guy's taking a lot of damage. Ah, oh, yes! Feel the power! <laughs> That's exactly what's gonna happen with this hero, right? Like, our damage output in that fight was enormous! We got so much damage in, right? We got so much damage in, we slowed them, we disrupted them. That's exactly what this hero is supposed to do. Did we end up dying? Fuck yeah, of course! I mean, what else are we gonna do? But we got done what we needed to do. Right? And I'm gonna buy a Ghost Scepter just to deal with the fucking OD. Like, I've had enough of that bullshit. I think that's probably the best way to go. Ghost Scepter. Ghost Scepter into Octarine. That seems pretty reasonable. Octarine is also sick because it reduces the cooldown on this shit. Right? Like, and these are really valuable. And we heal. Right? Like, we deal a lot of damage, which means we heal even more. That's not true. That's not true. We still deal more damage than we heal. Because that's just how the math works. But you get the idea, right? Like, we heal so much because of our damage output. It's very, very good. Very strong. With Vim and Dinner, plague our enemies. So, ah, out of range. Alright. Yes. Hello. Okay, let's put down another one of these. Let's get the hell out of here. <laughs> I don't want to die. I want to die. Just because I'm okay with dying doesn't mean I want to die, right? Double damage. 
We could totally smoke up and do Roshan or something. Not yet. I mean, it's pretty safe. Just because we have me. Right. I think I can scout the whole area. All of it. So, I don't know. So, yeah, DJ. Let's go be Gavino. Uh, well, let me just get my ghost scepter really quick. Mm, they're coming mid. Okay, that's interesting. Alright. Yeah, no. Uh, Go Scepter. You know. Blocks so much on their team, really. Like, almost everything. Almost everything. Like, they only have, like, two magic damage nukes. Three. Oh, okay. Alright, alright, alright. Okay, we got the ghost set there. Yup, you did. Nope. No, motherfucker. No. <laughs> ah. Alright. Well, we got those guys. The rest had to retreat. Right, that's the thing. Even if we don't kill them, they just have to leave. They just gotta get out of there. Because they can't fight into that. Right? Like, after all of that... You know, all of that damage, they're just out. Right? So... You know? We'll take it. And we're gonna go ahead and take Rashaan really cool. Gonna be an Aegis for the Juggernaut. Which is, of course, really, really useful. So, yeah. I guess with this hero, you will never be, like, the main guy. Like, oh my god, Rampages! Right? We're gonna be the guy where he's like, holy fucking shit, Venomans are stealing so much damage, we have to go back all the time. <laughs> That's good enough for me, man. I'll take it. Going bottom? Alright, let's go bottom. Let's go bottom. Let's do this. Oh, man. I'm really happy I got my Ghost Scepter, too. That shit, god, I guess so. OD, uh, maybe we should have gotten that a little while ago, but... Yeah, no, it wasn't that big of an issue. As you say. All right. Scout this out. Oh, what's up, man? What's up, man? I'm just gonna continue, continue on with these. Hello, I'm leaving. <laughs> Sorry, man, you're dead. You and your friends. Maybe not, maybe actually they're fine. Nah, they're not fine. Nobody is fine, man. No, 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 no. Fine. As if. As if. You're cute, man. You're cute. So cute. So cute. So cute. <laughs> Alright. There we go. And it all worked out in the end. Now we're sitting in their base with our little wards and sieging down their barracks. Ah, isn't that beautiful? I accidentally gave you my, uh... <laughs> Gonna need that back. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Why do... How does that even happen? Alright. Okay, then. So, yeah, I've been a monster. Oh, not mine. No. Ah, oh, help. Please. Ah! It was enough. No, well, that's alright. I'm coming back in. <laughs> Look at the weight. Screw that, man. This game is fucking over. What should I be waiting for, huh? What exactly? Oh, the dual victory, man. Oh, come on! You can't be serious! Rave King Aura, man. Rave King Aura. That shit is real. That is the realest aura. Alright, somebody's 2k MMR, apparently. Ah, sure somebody is. Alright. Well, let's go ahead and finish this one up really quick. That was a fun game, man. That was a fun game. I really enjoyed this one. Kind of need our Juggernaut for this. We don't really deal that much right kick damage. Not really all that much, God, I mean. Uh, 
There we go. Let's go down. Hey, what did he say? Lose to clown cause we have worst mid ever. <laughs> so that's the idea that chose to go safe lane. Dude, you know, I'm just saying, I'm just saying, you could have gone mid, no problem. Alright. Well then, boom! Randomans! Uh. Cool hero, push one, push two if not. Alright, alright, alright. I think we did pretty well. 590 GPM. That's the second highest in the game. Of course, the Juggernaut is the highest, but I mean, that's gonna happen, right? Like, yeah, we bought him so much time that he could just farm up. Um, I'm really just not at all surprised by that. Let me go ahead and do the giveaway really quick. Let me go ahead and do the giveaway really quick. So, today's winner would be Matt Crow with some weird things you win uh you win the uh, wait actually uh this oh uh, there you go not tradable can i gift it let me check really quick oh no i can't gift it okay how about this nope this nope all right thanks dollar uh Maybe gifted. What is this? Oh, it's like hair. Fuck, man. If you want some hair, feel free to send me a message. I'll give you some hair. <laughs> Alright, I hope you all enjoyed that video. If you did, please don't forget to leave a rating on the video. Hope to see you tomorrow. Goodbye.